When setting the bid strategy for your campaigns in Google Ads, you have an option to set a portfolio bid strategy and apply it across multiple campaigns. In Google Ads, a portfolio bid strategy lets you manage bids across multiple campaigns, ad groups, or keywords using a single bidding strategy. If you are running multiple campaigns in your account, but at the high level you have one specific goal for your business, whether it is conversions at a certain CPA or revenue at a certain ROAS, and it doesn't really matter for you where the conversions or revenue come from, Portfolio Bid Strategy can be a good solution for you. With Portfolio Bid Strategy, Google's AI will set bids to help you reach your performance goals across multiple campaigns. Let's review an example. You have three campaigns in your Google Ads account and you want to get conversions at $70 CPA. If you set a target CPA goal for each individual campaign, Google Ads will aim to achieve your specified target CPA across every campaign. But generally, different campaigns have different performance, so it might not be reasonable to set the same target for each campaign. This is where portfolio bid strategy can help you. If you set a target CPA for your portfolio and apply that portfolio to all three campaigns in your account, Google Ads will aim to reach that target at portfolio level which means across all campaigns in the portfolio. In that case, one campaign might overperform and achieve a CPA above your target, while another campaign might underperform and get a lower than average CPA. But because your objective is to get a certain CPA across all your campaigns, this shouldn't really matter because your average CPA across all your three campaigns is what you were trying to achieve. Portfolio bid strategy can be a good tool to streamline performance across multiple campaigns. However, it can have its disadvantages too. For example, if you sell products or services and you have one campaign that generally has a lower average order value, you might not be very keen on spending a lot on that campaign. So you would prefer to set a low bid for it because it's not very profitable for you. This is where portfolio bid strategy might not be a good solution. Because if you put that campaign in a portfolio, it can be possible that Google bids high in that campaign and brings a lot of conversions for you. Because if you put that campaign in a portfolio, it can be possible that Google bids high in that campaign and brings lots of conversions for you because search volume is high and it's easy to get conversions from that campaign. So, when using portfolio bid strategy, you should be confident that conversions across all campaigns in the portfolio have the same value for you and you don't really mind where the conversions come from. Now let's see how we can create a portfolio bid strategy in Google Ads. In your Google Ads account, on the left menu, go to Tools, then Budget and Bidding, and click on the Bid Strategies. When you click on the plus button to create a new portfolio bid strategy, it will ask you what bidding strategy you want to use, target CPA, target ROAS, or others. I'm going to click on target CPA here. You must give a name to your portfolio, specify the target CPA that you want to achieve at your portfolio, and select campaigns that you want to include in this portfolio bid strategy. After that, Google Ads will aim to achieve your specified average target CPA across all selected campaigns. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions regarding choosing the right bidding strategy for your campaigns, let me know in the comments. Thank you.